Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use DaVinci Macro and why it is so freaking OP to use. Um, so yeah, as you can see, I have a clip uh, here. I added some velocity. You don't need to, but that's fine. You need to drag an adjustment clip. Just how normal you would drag in a preset is because we're creating the macro right now. So I uh, just... Okay, this is the adjustment clip. Then you just uh, drag in a preset. I'm just gonna use uh, a pink glow. That's fine. So as you can see right here, you just, as normal as you would drag in a preset, just like that. So in here, you just wanna make sure that all the keyframes are lined up uh, normal. So just like that. Uh, so, yeah, that should be good. Then, what you want to do is just make sure that everything looks fine because you can not change this once you've created the macro okay now we want to create the macro so um you want to line these two i mean mark these two then macro create macro and then on the glow you just check everything just let's check everything there is I know it takes a bit of time, but trust me, it's worth it. You want to keyframe um, the S glow one brightness. Also, just check the value and do the. Just like that. Okay, and then you wanna uh, uh, click the value on a shake amplitude and see this, because that uh, the value is uh, the keyframes. So just like that, and you just wanna name the macro glow something pink. Let's just name it pink glow. Just like that, um, and then you just press enter. Uh, just save the name. And then you press close, and then this will pop up save changes to macro tool one and you want to find a folder um for the macro so i have mine <coughs> in here it's called the vinci macro so i'm just going to save it in here just like that so then you want to go into the effects library and go into edit templates and show folder and then you want to go into effects and as you can see mine is here but you need to open another folder where you have uh, the macros that you just created so here da vinci macro and you just want to press and copy and then paste it in here press ctrl v and now it is in here so <coughs> you can just close this now and as you can see they're right here it's right there so as we go out here i'm going to show you how to use it now um you add as you would an adjustment clip and you make sure to make it a compound clip or else it won't work um right click on it and compound clip make a shortcut for this it makes it much faster you press new compound clip and as you can see if you go into the effects here you can see that it is right there you might need to restart your program for it to work but it's good you just drag it on and as you can see it works totally fine so you can make the playback quarter resolution and then you can see it and you have a nice glow impact that's nice. So that's uh, that's how you use DaVinci Macro. Uh, it will make your editing speed speed so much faster. It's insane. I edited a Fortnite highlights in under 24 hours, and I normally do it in two to three days. But this helped me so much. So I hope this uh, this helps you too. Uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you all. We're so close to 1,000 subs, which is insane. So uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Yeah, see you in the next video.